edge and now in the ball, Liu Jingyu, China. Liu from China. Chinese men in second place. A lot of these athletes, like this young man, the next generation of great Chinese athletes. We've been watching them grow up as juniors in this competition. Whoa! Same vault that we just saw, but wow, that was a little bit hairy on the landing there. And of course, the men only have one chance. That hasn't changed from the new code. They still only get one vault. Actually, doesn't get his legs over his head quite well enough, and his knee that was there was some sound when he landed i mean it sounded like something awful happened when he hit the mat but he's walking fine and smiling through it 9.2 for liu jiangjie romanians have had a debacle here in honolulu and i tell you watching their training on parallel bars i I just don't know if it's going to get much better for them here. Well, a lot of the gymnasts here are saying that this is the one apparatus that seems to be the most difficult with the new rules. It's just very hard to put it all together on parallel bars. There are so many different things that you need to accomplish in an exercise that you didn't have to do before. Right there, you see the legs come apart. Nice element here. This is not going to bring in a big score. It's remarkable if you can't do a skill called a peach basket or a giant type element on parallel bars. It's, it's almost discrimination. It's so hard to bring in a big score. Across the floor here in Honolulu to Morgan Hom on the high bar. This will be a test for Morgan. New first element, new release right, skill. Right here. And a little bit sloppy. His release. Whoa. Right on his fingertips there. Full twisting double laid out somersault right here. All right. Step on the landing. This is not one of Morgan's best routines, but it really is remarkable. Even when they're good, things go great for them, but exactly, Kevin Majika saying, fight, fight. These kids, when their back's up against the wall, they somehow can get it done. The United States trying to hold on to their lead. Morgan Ham there and his twin brother when we come back to Hawaii. <laughs> Back in Hawaii at the Pontiac American Team Cup, we have to say, we could not get the Chinese and the Romanian men out of the water. The American men were a little bit more leery about the strong Hawaiian sun. Feng Jing. Still in the fourth rotation. Same vault that we've seen. Kasamatsu with a full twist. Way off to the side. Dangerously off to the side. It's not good when you almost hit the judges. Actually starts the vault too early. His legs don't get over his head. Starts pushing too soon, starts twisting too soon. You'll see his legs come off around axis, and it is real scary when you're landing like that. That won't help the Chinese men. Right now, it is the United States, Romania, and China. 8.6 for Morgan Ham. United States in the lead. Here's Paul. Come on, Paul. And the United States on the high bar. Two scores in the eighth, so they'll keep one of those. Paul Hong, USA. Big routine here. Paul is doing a number of new elements in this competition. And probably his most difficult, biggest addition to his gymnastics repertoire comes on high bar. Right here. Full twisting Kovacs. He's got it. Little bit, little bit of form, though. <laughs> hate, hate to be so critical, but... You know, that's 
that's what's so impressive about these guys is they come out with new routines, brand new, huge skills, and they hit them. Yes, the form's off just a little bit, but come that on, will come, come in time. Actually landing a little bit close on both of those releases. Double, double. Yeah. Bang. Well, they like it here in the Blaisdell Center. But Tim, what you mean is when you reattach your body to the bar, you want to be almost fully extended? Yeah, you want your arms to be straight, and mostly for a skill like a Kovacs, you just want to swing right through the handstand again. He catches with bent arms, and that, that can be a deduction. Also breaks a little bit of rhythm. Well, let's watch right here. This is the new element. You see how his elbows are bent when he grabs the bar and the legs come apart a little bit. Just an opportunity they for the get, judges. Yeah, if they want to get critical, and they did, they can take those deductions. Well, at least it's in the nines. Xia Zhenwei, awesome score on the rings. Tim called him the strongest man in the world with a 955. I was going to say, not a very strong start value here on ball. The first few Chinese men have been in the 9-7 range. And this one's only out of a 9-2. And that means that's the highest he could possibly get if he was perfect. Yes, he's not going to get a, a big score, not even in the nines, I would gather. Dorian Petku, and you saw the uh, Romanians will also keep a very low number here on parallel bars. Five competitors, you keep the four best. And the amount that they're choosing to do, I don't know, it's uh, very, very odd. What do you mean? Well, just very unorthodox, and I would say probably a deduction right off the bat. There are a lot of very technical rules in the sport of gymnastics, and I don't believe you can mount the bars the way they are. This competition is also a bit of a learning experience because for many of these countries, they're checking out the other countries to see where they're going with the new rules. What kind of skills are they doing on each of the events? Yeah, the American coaches, Ron Brandt, who oversees the men's program, has been videotaping everything that's going on here. Jia Jian Wei, 8.95. And it's going to be lower for our Romanian friend. Boy, are there some growing pains here today or what? Yeah. Another score in the eights. Like I said, if you can't do a good giant skill on parallel bars, you're really, really in trouble. Now, guys, is this almost unfair, what the sport is asking the gymnasts to do? They do it every four years, just about. It's kind of a little bit crazy. Keep everyone on their toes. The one thing I don't understand on men's high bar is the audience really takes to the high-flying skills, but you won't typically see the big New score. right here. Uh, skills just like that. Now, once again, as Paul Han, he, Sean landed a little bit close to the bar on that. If he hadn't, he was going to do another release skill right afterwards. He's getting so much better at that, too. Critical time, sticking that landing, putting the explanation mark on the routine. I'm telling you, this guy, he's built for the code. He's got the right body. He seems fresh mentally. You know, he's got a whole new confidence level, too. He said the only thing he needs to work on is polish. Chinese would love to lose that 8.95. Tai Tong Fei could do that if he scores in the nines here. This is the hardest vault they have so far. It can happen. Handspring, two and a half front. Oh, ho! Oh. Room to spare. Lot, a lot of power on that vault. You're gonna love this one, Al. That one's only out of a 9.8. That's just ridiculous. Hard to believe. I think you run down, <laughs> do that vault, legs together, stick it, you can get a 9.8. What are these judges thinking? Not right. 